Oh, what's going on, everybody here? And welcome to a little game called Let's School. Today, we're doing the first 30-ish of it. And uh, yeah, we're going to hop into a new game mode. We're just going to hop into a new game. Leave everything uh, secure, valiant, normal, fantastic. Let's hop into this. I believe this is a school building kind of game. And it looks pretty interesting. looks pretty neat. We're going to check it out. Hopefully, you guys enjoy If you're interested, link down below. Hey, long time I'm no see. I'm the headmaster of your old school. All right. So they're telling us a story about why we're here and how we're here. Oh, we're going to make a person. Oh, cool. Okay. Hold on. Let me make my person. All right, we got a character here. Uh, his name is Slen. Slen Derman. <laughs> I don't know why that game is just funny. Oh, we're gonna scare the we're gonna scare them to death. Oh, it's gonna be so good. <laughs> okay, so our school name is gonna be Silent Hills. <laughs> and uh, we need to make sure that everyone is wearing uh, just just black. Just that's probably the most appropriate thing that they could probably be wearing. Okay, that works. I don't think we can do anything else. All right, done. Fantastic. Let's get into it. Uh, Slen Derman is the head person at Silent Hills School. Oh my gosh, there's something wrong with that man right there. <laughs> it's so good. Silent Hills. Oh gosh, it's such a quaint, quiet little town. There's actually not a whole lot going on anywhere, anything, unless you're roaming down the halls and you hear certain things There's, the, the doors are even destroyed already oh man give us a nice foggy background and some like questionable sounds where we good uh are you the new headmaster i i am i'm miss lynn your assistant okay <laughs> try try to make this game as dark as we can <laughs> oh kidding kidding feel free to ask me for help if you encounter any difficulties i might be have a lot of experience but i'll do my best okay cool so do i actually get to build this place uh would you like to go through this tutorial yeah i probably should Try move the camera. Okay, so let's see. We've got this. We've got this. Uh, let's see. We got this. Okay, and then we have we have that. Okay, so seems like I got all that. Uh, there's more to the, the the more than one floor to this building. Let me show you upstairs. Okay, so current floor is one. Uh, so we can do F. Oh, we can do R. Oh, to go up and down. Oh my gosh, there's even a clock tower. Let's go. Looks like you're already getting the hang of this. Yep, fantastic. I can do the things. Okay. Uh, education goals. Hello, Headmaster. Let me do first you introduce you to our goal. First, we must admit students from all communities around and satisfy their needs. Have the students attend classes so they gain knowledge points. Throughout the week, teach the students so they can pass the exam for their preferred course types at the end of the week. When the students pass the exams, the school gains contribution points, which can be used to further improve the school. Uh, we can increase the school level by renovating the facilities, admitting new students, and more. Please gain a higher score and level. Okay, cool. Do I get to do some building? Uh, greetings, Headmaster. I'll be your building consultant, Brick Johnson. My gosh, Brick Johnson. What a wonderful name for an engineer. Uh, this building has the same regular uh, use in ages. I'm sure you don't want your students to see this place in like a dump. It's tidy up first. You know, I really liked the cracked, uh, the missing wall in the front. Like it was actually quite nice. So, um, okay, so what do we need to do? Click to clear. So he wants me to bulldoze this stuff out of here okay all right so we bulldoze that that was easy never seen this place so clean and tidy before <laughs> oh let's first build a classroom what about the gaping hole in the front i mean <laughs> the cracks in the wall i love it uh, you know what i love it it's just fine click the build panel uh facility and classroom okay so minimum size is 20 squares so i feel like this should be the classroom right here right and nobody shall ever be able to leave. Mm, I wonder if we can trap them in the building. <laughs> no, that's that's not nice. That is not nice. We don't do that. We don't do that. Okay, so there's the classroom. The classroom will be at the end of the hall. All right, so it looks like we're going to have uh, one massive classroom. Holy moly. And then what is this? A shabby podium? Oh, hold on. Uh, Z and C to rotate. Wow. Q and E was taken. Uh, okay, so let's go with... We'll go with right there and then what is this where does this need to be i you know uh probably right there and then shabby podium we have that we have lunch box holders these kids think they're gonna be able to have lunch here <laughs> oh i don't even think so how many of these do i need? how many of these do we need okay that looks good and then we're gonna have one at the back that one right there that's gonna be the classroom snitch that's gonna be the teacher's pet right there. And we're gonna make sure that they're keeping an eye on all these guys right here. Okay, so we have those. 
Is that all we need? Uh, now click down on the edge to exit facility editor and save the changes made. Oh my gosh. Hello, I'm Edison Liu, the school's teaching consultant. It seems like you've already recruited some students or you're ready to. Uh, they are the school's foundation. Visit the local community to get started. Children of all ages, I have a wonderful opportunity for you. Come to Silent Hills with me, Slen, Durman, for all your educational needs. No, we don't talk about what happened in the last group of students at the school or why there's cracks in the walls that are glowing. No, uh, this is where the uh, potential students are. Okay, a lot of children in this community. Wait, so we're just like randomly coming up to children playing. It's like, hey, you want to come to my school? Just hop in my van first. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna establish admissions office so here so students may uh, apply their app. Wait, we're gonna put an admissions office? View local students. Is this is this how teaching works? Like schools literally just go to <laughs> go to the parks, local parks, and it's like come learn with me. Uh, establish admissions office. Are you sure you want to admit students from here? Yeah. Opened administration office. Okay, open for administration. Um student type forgetful has asper uh, aspirations, College of Marketing, Exam Completion Award. Uh, I don't even know knowledge points needed for final exam. Okay, cool. That sounds good. I don't know. I don't. I don't know that we should be super picky right now. Admit all. Oh, we're not being picky. <laughs> Take everybody. We'll get who we can. We gotta feed the beast. I mean, we need more points. Uh, it's time to assign new students to a classroom and pick a homeroom teacher. One through one, select class members. Select all. Homework teachers are needed to manage students, otherwise the students will have a disciplinary issues. Now assign a teacher to the classroom, homeroom teacher. Oh, who do we get? Miss Lynn? Oh, we, okay. You know what? I feel like you were only nice to me because you wanted a job. So uh, that's fine. That's fine. Class preparations are now complete. Let's unpause and let the school activities continue. During daylight hours, students and teachers will come to start uh, a new day of life at the school. Click the button to start time. Okay, but what happens? Uh, <laughs> nobody wants to address this L or that. And there's like, there's no bathrooms. Did anybody realize there's no, there's no bathrooms? There's, I uh, guess not. Uh, we're making, are we making money right now? Oh, we are making money. Should we, um, our parents said we aren't smart enough to study, but we uh, never believe them. I hope Silent Hill's <laughs> Help those from Verdant Valley make our dreams come true. Okay. Um, I feel like we should do some building. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, management office, research room works. Oh, hold on. Uh, buildings. I feel like this needs to be dealt with. Doors, staircases, roofs, hollows, pillars, teaching building. How do I get... So, hold on. Uh, oh, this guy can't see anything. Is there no lights in there? He's completely blind. I love it. They're never going to learn anything in there. Uh, how do I... Okay, can I build in here? Demolish? No, buildings. Uh, doorways and windows? Maybe I put a window in here. Floor to ceiling window. Oh! There's the lights. Okay. And what about little windows? Okay, they, they get little windows back here. Okay. Is that better? Looks like they might be able to see... A little bit now. No, the students are already learning to plan out their brand new life. Is okay. Oh, I feel like we definitely missed some building steps here. <laughs> they can't see anything. How do we have? How do they have light in here? Oh, it's from all the holes everywhere. Okay. Uh, do we not have any fur? Oh, furniture. Uh, lights. Hmm. Hey, I found the lights. I found the lights. Don't worry. Now they can see. <laughs> um, okay. So we need to we need to build a schedule here. So estimated exam results, total fails. So academics, humanities, science, is sports and arts. Those require sports, those require science. There are four different types of courses according to their aspirations, different students will need to gain uh, knowledge points. Okay. Estimated school exam, insuff insufficient science and knowledge points. Okay. Okay, so humanities, period one. Uh, and then this is our estimated pass, estimated fail. Okay, hold on. So how many, how many humanities do we need? We, uh, do you, you all need humanities? They all need humanities and they all need, uh, a science-y thing. Okay, so there's that. And then, oh, do we have to do like every, do we have to do every, every day? Hold control, drag with the, oh, control, drag. Well, I want to do all of them. Oh, hold on. 
Monday to Tuesday. Ah, hey, there we go. Okay, so they're only here for what, four? So they're here for like a month. So it's like, okay, this month, and then these two are the tests for these. Okay, all right, I'm understanding this. That's actually kind of cool. So this is working, this is working. We have 79,000. I feel like we need to make our school better though. Do we have like, what were the other rooms that we have? Um, classroom management, research, women's room, master, men's room, tea room, headmaster's office, we have that. We don't have any of these. Everyone gets their water from here, resolves thirst. I feel like we need to fix everything. Should we try to fix everything? Let's try to fix everything. Let's 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 try. We'll see what happens. Here. Let me get the bulldozer. We're gonna go ahead and fix all these. Oh wow, look at that. It just deletes the cracks. The bulldozer fixed the cracks. Very nice. Look at that. Oh my gosh, we're just cleaning up all the junk everywhere. And we're getting like money for it. How nice is oh my gosh. That's our restroom? Oh no, thank you. That is not okay. I get this place cleaned up. This is just this is a, what a, what kind of what were they running here? You know what kind of oh that is definitely like a, a a gym pad of sorts. Okay, so we got all of oh nope not all done. Hold on, there we go. Okay, now we're good. Now we're all cleaned up. Okay, so what we need to make we do need to make we need to make bathroom bathroom restrooms whatever you call them. Uh, we need to make them. So men's room and a women's room. We got to make those. It's got to happen. So minimum size is twelve squares. So that is a three by four or a three by four this way. Oh, that'll actually work out perfect. Okay, so if we do that, oh, hold on. I, I meant to I meant to rotate. No, incorrect, wrong. Okay, can we get those in there? And then hold on, we need a door. And then we need, hold on. Ex where is like, is there a sink? What is this? A cat litter box. Why would there be a cat litter box? Oh, a simple sink, a trash can, an outdoor sink, simple cleaning supplies, a small garbage bin. Okay. We need this. They can wash their hands. They're dirty, dirty, grubby little hands. And then can't put a trash can in there, which is unfortunate. But you know what? It is what it is. So now let's do the same thing. Oh, there's like a temperature? Ice tray. What year are we in? <laughs> Lights? Uh... They're not gonna be able to see what wait, do we need a light inside of each each poopatorium? I feel like we might need a light in there. <laughs> that way that you don't want to poop in the dark. <laughs> okay. Alright, that looks good. That looks good. Okay, so now um let's see. Is that is that good? Are we good there? I think so. I feel like that's probably solid. Do we need a window in here? Maybe, just so we can uh let the smells out. Okay, that looks good. All needs satisfied. So let's go ahead and check mark that. Let's get a, uh, that was a men's. Let's get the women's. Do the same thing. And we're gonna do the same exact thing, but on the opposite side. That way there's no peeping, you know? You can't, you can't have that. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, we have, we have like an all thing here, but do we need a, do, do we need a lunchbox storage in there? I don't think so. I think we're probably good. What is this? Outdoor sink while plain and simple. It can be used to wash hands, provides washing one. Okay, so there's that. So we've got men's room and a, a women's room. Look at that. See, we did we supplied something that they didn't have before. Now, what other rooms do we have? So we've got management office research room. Uh, we've got that. We got a tea room, twenty per square. Everyone gets their water from here. Management office, um, research room. So I kind of want to fill in something right here. Is that is this big enough? Minimum size is sixteen squares. This is only twelve squares. What is this? Eighteen nine. For a management office? Let's try that. Let's see if we can get some. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work. Uh, what is this? Office desk, telephone table. Okay, we'll put that in there. Uh, hold on. We need a door. And then possibly one of those. Oh, you only get one of those. Okay. And then we need maybe, maybe a window or two. Or how about a window? Uh, a light. And then do we need hygiene in here? Probably not. Temperature, nah, they're fine. Exclusively got all those. Okay, so that's all, wait, hold on. Why are we not good? Facility not gonna be, facility needs to be reachable. Oh, that wasn't, that right there was a, um, that wasn't a door. Uh, there's the door, yes. Okay, so now we have, look at that, a management office. Uh, management department one, select a department room icon. Uh, we'll put that one. That one looks good. 
and uh yeah assign a manager <laughs> just miss lynn as well as no uh we're not gonna do that yet okay so we need to put something in there but now you see what i mean like now we're actually making like some kind of hall looking thing so we could put something in here as well um but do we need anything else we probably need the tea room the tea room could probably use to be built um let's do this let's do that hold on and then that is that big enough i feel like this should work let me go ahead and let me get let's get this thing outfitted here okay i think we got everything in here we got we got those uh, there's no like tables though i mean i guess decor maybe what is this steam reviews monster oh look at that that gives us a thing um i didn't see anything like there's some exclusive stuff we had a hot water station we had a cup rack and then a kettle so like the kettles here cups are here hot water stations here uh but like there's no like furniture where's like the furniture at you know i was looking for exclusive lights doors decoration i was like where's like a, a couch like something to sit on anything well you know what i guess that'll work for now okay so we got our tea room look at this i mean look at this place you wouldn't even know that it was uh it was it was silent hill school would you you'd have no idea uh okay hold on there was actually furniture where was that steam thing at i mean we got like a steam review deal might as well put that right in the middle oh my gosh look at that it's beautiful probably should throw some lights in here i would hate to get sued especially we don't want to answer any questions if we don't have to you know what i'm saying maybe throw a hanging light in here wait is that a hanging light that's an incandescent top light okay what's well, like orange interesting very interesting okay hold on actually you know what uh where's the doors and windows let's get a, let's get some full length windows in here make it look make it you know what make it feel a little bit nicer okay we're good did we do everything i think we did everything <laughs> i don't think there's anything else oh we have the research room we got the tea room we got the uh headmaster's office is actually already over here which is us slender man I feel like we should connect this though you know what i mean like we, we should probably put a door here and connect this because i shouldn't have to walk outside for any reason whatsoever okay i think we're good let's get out of the build menu um uh yeah we're good so let's go ahead and play and let's see what it wants us to do now can we hire anybody else management course what is this i spent school exam results days until next te next test is four days they're going through period one right now. We have $68,000. Um, headmaster's inventory. Panda egg and a cat egg. Hatch this for a cat. Hatch this for a panda. Interesting. Headmaster's office. What is this? Um, management status. Men's room. Management status. Five, five. Managed department. No personnel assigned. Management status. I'm not sure what this is yet. What do we have here? Current school level tutoring program. Score needed for next upgrade, 200. What is this? The facility needs staff to operate. How do I, yeah, but how do I get more staff? Hey, they did something. Um, I don't know, can I hire, recruit? Verdant Valley, teacher recruitment. <gasps> oh, science teacher, humanities teacher, science teacher. Uh, recruitment methods, talent marketplace. Daily wage, 114. Who is, where's the management proficiency? 12, actually you're fairly high on the management proficiency and you're super cheap. Let's recruit that person. And then in here, we'll go ahead and let's see, is it this one? Nope, never mind, never mind, never mind. Uh, we need to put in you, you, and unqualified. Mm. Well, that's fantastic. What about this room? Uh, let's see, hold on. Where is homeroom teacher? Can I put you in there? What are you teaching? Proficiencies in, I don't know what, oh, I don't know what all those things are. How do I get him to be better? <laughs> you know, I just realized there's no door going back outside. Uh, hello, headmaster. I'm Miss Sweet, your lifestyle consultant. Oh, you've already built a tea room. Looks like you have some experience with the school lifestyle. Good job. Okay, cool, thank you. Um, hold on, we didn't, we need to build a, a way out so let's get rid of that let's go in our build mode and let's get into um furniture doors get a double nice double door in here can we get uh a window there a window there all right that looks good that way they can actually go out here 
because they keep trying to sit down. See, where are these benches at? Oh, there's security. Simple firefighting equipment and shabby fire alarm. Oh, not bad, actually. That's that's actually probably a good thing. Uh, and then maybe we have a firefighting system standby right there. Maybe one there just in case. Oh. Oh, I didn't realize there's... Oh my gosh, there's more stuff. Oh, look at that. Hold on just a second. Let's get some seats in here. Uh, we need to get some seats in here. Like they need to be able to sit down and eat their... And drink their tea and enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Didn't realize there was all this stuff. Okay, I think we're good. I think... We are solid now. I hired a teacher and he can't even do this job, which kind of sucks. <laughs> it's terrible. Requirement positions, unqualified. Well, darn. I wish they would get better. Can I fire this person now? Oh, we have low aesthetics? That's, we can't have that. We cannot have low aesthetics. Okay, we worked on aesthetics a little bit. Hold on, what do we got here? Uh, uh oh, some students are secretly playing a video game. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh, they were secretly playing a video game. Those rascals, them. Can't even believe that. Oh, you know what I just realized? Let's prank. Let's prank is a popular drama series currently airing on television. Some students would uh, be naughty once they get their hands on it, making them much harder to manage. My students are turning delinquent. Oh my gosh. Hold on. We need to move that because that was right in the door. Um, how do we how do we come deal with them being delinquent? I feel like we need the management people, you know? Uh, how do we in implement whooping times? <laughs> Where, how do I do? Oh wait, hold on, number of staff. Oh, here we go. Okay, how do I assign? I can't assign you there. You're not qualified. Uh, toilets, nature calls, the students need toilets. Hey, guess what? I already got toilets. They're already there. Oh, don't go outside and use, okay, good. Look at that, see, easy peasy. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. It's so funny. It hurts. Three new student applications received. Oh, man. Do we admit them all? Oh, but the problem is, how do I... Okay, so if I... Let's see. Hold on. Admit all. All the elements students have admitted, admitted. But now what? Because their schedules are going to be off. So, number of students. Class. Not... To, oh. So, we would have to assign them to a class. Not assign to a class. Um, so can I assign them to this class? Number of students, four of seven. Okay, do I assign and assign? The only problem is they're like late in their, in their teachings. They're not gonna make it. A normal meeting, hell, holy class meeting to get ready for the day. So they're not gonna, estimate it fails is three. Do I need to make another classroom? Hold on a second. We might have to actually make another classroom here. The new students seem to be a rather, to be rather weak in humanities. Let's check on them uh, first. Stop the clock so we can focus on this task. Okay. Find and check uh, the overview of a forgetful student. I'm taking a stroll. Forgetful. Bad memory learns slower in humanities course. Memory at minus 40%. Oh, God. This student is forgetful with poor memory. They are slow at learning humanities course. Uh, now, let's check on the schedule. The student is unable to achieve their major goal. Increase a teacher's proficiency through training. Okay, so what do I do now? Training, zero of one. Teaching proficiency, management proficiency, research proficiency. Time needed, 0.2 days. Okay, hold on a second. What is this, guys? Why don't we put this guy in and have her go to management? You know what I'm saying? I feel like that might be the move. Like, hold on, let's do this. I'm going to switch you out with you. And then we're going to move you. I feel like you'd rather be a manager. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so we have that there, but then we have this here, and then, hold on, let's go ahead and look at our schedule. So we're still not looking good. However, we can do training and we can do teaching proficiency. Confirm. Slen Derman starts training. Oh, we're gonna start training. Training has started. After some time, the teacher's proficiency will increase. Okay, cool. Um, oh, do I have to re... 
do this? Uh oh, we might have to redo all of this. Wait, why is why is there why are we split up here? Why is Miss Lynn teaching period one? I'm teaching period two. Miss Lynn's doing three. This guy, but then this guy's doing class meeting. Homeroom teacher. I'm I'm kind of confused here. Okay, so now Bianca Taylor is assigned to these, but I'm assi I'm assigned to sciences. I guess it's because I'm the science person. I'm not I'm not actually sure what's what's going on there. But we'll we'll see what's going on here. Uh, uh oh. Froggy Dash. A student brought a frog to school. Affecting normal class order. Teacher unassigned. Oh my gosh. Uh all right. Well, I guess we're gonna assign uh this person there. Oh, stop! <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't do it again. I won't. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. Okay. So are we are we good now? Is everything looking better now? Like let's look at our schedule here. See, it still looks like we're gonna have three people failing, which is is not is not good. Um so I need uh relax. Teaching proficiency required. Teaching proficiency required. See, she needs higher teaching proficiency, but she's not doing anything. She's not oh wait, no, that's Bianca Taylor. Oh shoot. Training. Oh, she's in training. Okay, so she should uh she should hopefully be good i don't know wait a second do i have do i, I have me do i have slenderman doing the training i do slenderman is doing the training wait where's the bianca person at then you you're not <laughs> they're not even unable to train no free training they're not even doing the training oh my gosh <laughs> i messed up everything so i guess one teacher can't just teach everything i guess is that what was going on Okay, so training course for Slen and Durman completed. So we can confirm that. So now what I need to do is I need to go in here and then we need to get check on our uh, people. So let's see. Uh, hold on a second. That was not the right way one way to go. Can we go into this way and go to Bianca Taylor and then go to train teacher training proficiency. Continue. Starts training. Okay. So now she's training. So now let's also look at we go into here. We look at this. So right now we're still having three people fail, but uh, we should once once they're trained up, they should. Oh, they might not even actually. They honestly might not even make it to be able to train. <laughs> Darn it. We might need to increase their proficiency again. I'm starving headmaster. Is there anywhere I can buy some food? I see. Uh, asking for a food tent to resolve this, you'll need to research that first. Oh, <gasps> there's research? What? Where's research? I didn't know there's research. Headmaster's inventory. Course. Uh, what is this? New courses, new facilities, new furniture, etc. can be unlocked through research. You must first build a research room. Oh, that's what the research building. Keep a research room operating. Oh, that's what the research room is. I assume that it was part of a, um, well, not that, you know, how big does this have to be? What is the minimum size on this thing? Um, on management research, 18 squares. So if I did actually, if we move this a little bit, we could probably do something four by four is not 18 it's 12. Hmm. No, that's 16. Okay. That's not going to work. Let's do this. Let's put it right in here. Can we put it in here? Uh, oh, we have to build that though. See, let's go to buildings. Uh, teaching building. Roofs, hollows, pillars. How do I get this to make a... Oh, here, add. Okay, construction mode. There. Is that... Okay, so... Build that. How long does this take? Holy moly, this is gonna take forever. Why does it look like it's going underground? I have no idea. So it looks like there's a progress bar right here. Maybe. Oh yeah, there it goes. Okay, it's actually being built now. Now we can actually see something going. Oh, okay, here we go. All right, so once that gets built, we'll make that our research room, I guess. Okay, there it is. There's our new little school area. All right, so now we can go in here. We can build a research room that takes up, let's see, that'll work. And then we just gotta basically put all these required things in here. Okay, is that everything that we need? Let's see, hold on. Decorations, doors, and windows. Let's get some windows in here. That looks good. Why is there a frog? Uh-oh, we got a frog action going on here. Let's get some lights. 
perfect that looks good do we need hygiene we'll put a little dustpan by the door right there and then temperature looks okay so we should be good okay so now we should be able to research go ahead and build that the research room requires at least one researcher to be working for research to start teachers with research capability will research faster okay research uh, so i don't have anybody so we need to find somebody that has research capabilities what is going on here what's going on here oh we gotta assign somebody uh get over here deal with that kid let's put this away let's get some staff uh recruit staff we have some new staff come in so teacher recruitment uh let's see where is the research proficiency so you have the highest research proficiency 286 are you absolutely oh you have really good training proficiency though too okay we'll recruit you and i'll put you steve cook we'll put you in there uh to begin research select a research goal for now select food tent as it can resolve hunger okay so now we have oh we have a new tab yeah school food tent okay oh then there's like playground oh there's a whole bunch of stuff research has started however at least one person is required to work in the research room the more research you have the researchers you have the more uh the sooner research will be completed okay so we're good there uh the problem is we're not making a ton of money yet so we've got to make sure that we're not like just going in the hole here um also another thing that i am uh noticing is i think we're gonna need to build another classroom <laughs> uh and the reason for that is because this classroom is once again getting we have we have two new students um and they're gonna be behind if we can't if you want to build a first class you can work hard in many different directions let's work hard for the future okay oh i want to educate the best of the best i want students from all over i want to build the most people i want to educate the best of the best like of course now that you have a school goal in mind let's check to see what needs to be done click check on it uh new facility oh look at that okay so we've done that and then increase admissions number gain contribution points new facility uh, research completed food tent okay cool victory goal teaching a victory and graduate 20 students with five star aspirations graduate 40 oh okay so we can select that and then that will tell us that's pretty cool okay so you can kind of pick like which way you want to go and like what you want to what you want to do if you want to build just a fancy school uh achieve 8,000 total basic uh building score build any basic wonder um 200 or more total number of high of students ensure high satisfaction for money that's pretty neat oh my gosh we have things one case of delinquent conduct uh needs more researchers or their construction oh well they, he's not he i don't think the teachers got here yet and then i feel like we need another um i feel like we need another classroom because we have more students waiting but if we get them into here they're gonna be too late to get all this stuff done so it's not great and then who is doing where is this where's the training going on you you should be training oh you are training oh look at our research guys researching look at him research oh, does he have headphones on or is that his briefcase on his face it's just briefcase on his face it definitely is okay welcome to silent hills <laughs> oh, that's so funny all right i think everything is going swimmingly what we got here there's research going how are you doing with your teaching still learning as the number of faculty uh facilities grow we'll run out of space if you need more space we can hire contractors to expand our outer wall build six squares of oh big oh oh look at that you can even expand out these ways holy moly that would be a giant school uh you know what though we do need to actually expand probably for um probably for another classroom here so we'll go ahead and get that going get that thing started that should keep that should look about even i think we need to build this thing so it's a little bit more symmetrical <laughs> all right she should be about done training come on bianca let's go you should be about done training you done training not yet all right bianca's training course has completed she's went from four to nine confirm wait what hold on a second that is not what we needed though was it no training i didn't do research proficiency i did training proficiency uh did i did i not so was this one selected i didn't so 
I didn't select. I don't even know. Confirm. I I, I don't even know because I swore we we selected training or for for teaching. I must have. I must have clicked the wrong thing. Okay, so we can get a food tent now. How exciting! Um, is there a food tent? Facility school provides simple lunches. Oh, it just goes outside. That's kind of neat. Should we go ahead and just like fill it in? Maybe like right in here. How big does this need to be? Let's do like that. Oh, that's super cool. That is so neat. Uh, pile of materials for food tent and then eating areas. Oh, that's super cool. That is such a neat little thing. Oh, I love that. That is so cool. That is so neat. <laughs> Very neat. Okay, so we have all those. Um, do we need do we need lights? I mean, if I guess uh just in case. Hygiene. Oh, here's an outdoor sink. And then a small garbage bin. Maybe not a terrible idea. There. Okay. That's cool. I like that. Uh-oh. One meat, two veggie combo. Charcoal bun what uh one me two why would we sell a charcoal bun that sounds awful so please assign a nutritionist to food tent oh we gotta now we gotta find a nutritionist okay so let's go ahead and recruit staff what is nutritionist management proficiency training teaching proficiency i don't know what nutritionist would be maybe it would say up here uh nutritionist i don't really know also, we did, guess what? We checked it out. We got started on a new classroom over here. We're uh, we're probably gonna have to work on that because we have someone is initiating some demands. Click to jump. What? As an educator. What? What is, what is your, what is, what is your demand? A few days of hard work, they should ask for a break room so they can rest and recharge. For oh, okay. That's easy enough. Click research. They want a break room. Oh, management, staff break room. Okay. Easy enough not even difficult we can get that going no problema okay so we got a staff break room going but let's see we need to get this i need to get this uh we gotta get this class started oh my gosh let me over here it's causing some issues uh let's reprimand them <laughs> they're active because they can't go play we need a bit we need to get a playground built too oh, we got all kinds of things to do but i need to get a teacher in here so we can get some because we have uh student admissions we have more students wanting to come in but i don't have anybody to teach them you know, I don't think we're gonna. I don't think. I don't think we're gonna pass this. If I go into this uh, schedule here, I, she's not. This this teacher is not. It's not learning fast enough. Um, and it is because of what are they not gonna pass? Is it because of literature? Hmm. And you know what? I don't have anybody else uh, that is any better at literature points. So they've got 14, but that's that's nothing. They can't even learn any faster. Uh, they could learn faster, but oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do here because I need you to finish this training, but they're not finishing the training. I mean, they're going to be close, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, did she finish? I think she might have finished. Did she finish? She did not finish yet. You know what? I'm going to hire this guy. I'm going to hire this Jeffrey Evans guy, and I'm just going to start training him to become a better teacher. And what is this guy? Rudimentary management certificate. Management proficiency time plus two. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't need an art teacher either, but you know what? Maybe we should go ahead and get the art teacher in here. So that way they can start. Uh, we can start teaching them and then they could. Where do we increase our study stuff at? I have no idea. Also, still have no idea who we can throw here. I mean, I guess we could throw one of these guys in here. Might as well. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Bianca is about done with her training, but it's like I don't know if it's gonna I don't know if it's gonna be too little too late. Because I mean these people are like they're like oh, so close, but not quite. Oh, not quite there. Okay, training course for Bianca has completed. Let's confirm. Let's see. Did that change anything whatsoever? Are you absolutely kidding me? They are ab about there. Well, hold on. It's raising. Maybe not. Oh, uh, I wonder if I could change. Can we change the class meeting? No, it doesn't look like we can change a class meeting to get another, uh, an additional, like, if we drop a science down, I mean, okay, these people are going to make it, but these people are not. No, oh, darn. So close. Uh, estimated exam failure is more humanities knowledge points required. 
they're not going to have the humanity points needed in order to make it through. And you know what the problem is? We don't also we also don't have a teacher that's more suitable. Uh, I mean, unless what is what is slender what is Slenderman's like teaching? Maybe maybe we should swap them. Oh, we can't swap them because she's. Oh. Uh, mm-hmm. Can't swap them out. Can't do anything. Okay, so if I swap out. <laughs> if I swap out everything to humanities, it looks like we might. Wait, hold on. If I swap this out to literature, we might be able to pass everything. So the last class of sciences right now, I don't know where the exams went. No idea where the exams went. Um, but they're, I don't know. I have no idea, but we're going to do one more thing of sciences and then it's, <laughs> it's all literature from here on out, baby. <laughs> and then we got to get another class going as well. But the problem is I don't have any, I don't have any literature teachers. Everybody's science teachers. Nobody's, uh, nobody's literature. So like can't start a new class with just a literature teacher. So we also just unlocked the ability for the staff room. So we probably need to go ahead and get that going. Uh, and let's see how everything's looking here. <laughs> Are we actually gonna, is everybody gonna like graduate on time? I don't know. Oh no. Oh no, we have two estimated failures in science now. Oh no, we just like just swapped it with something else. Oh man. Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. What if we put the people that only need one certain type of thing in one room? <laughs> like everything is in one room and then we just switch them to the other room when they need it like so like this person's good to go they're gonna pass they're good to go they're good to go they're good but they actually need more science they need more research they need more of everything but like what if i make this classroom wait what oh we're on that one okay what if i do sciences on this and then what we'll do is we'll swap. So as soon as it's like that guy's good and that one's good and that one's good. And I don't need to worry about those. This person right here needs to go to class one, two, because they're already good on that. So they need to go to one, two and then, oh my gosh, we got this. We got this figured out. So as soon as they, and as soon as they hit the, uh, the necessary requirements, like we, uh, we just swap them out. So like the only other one we should have to swap out is this one right here. Okay, we're getting close. We're getting close to this one. This one just needs 21. We're gonna pause, we're gonna switch them. Come on, come on, get the 21. Hit it, 21. Are you kidding me? They didn't hit 21. Oh my gosh, they hit 20 of 21, but they didn't have, no! <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Oh, I don't know if they, no, they need 21. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait. Which I don't know how this is gonna work because this is like a, this is algebra locked. Well, you know what? It's funny. It is what it is. Okay, come on. We're going to see if this works. If this works, it's going to be amazing. If it doesn't, then I don't know. We're going to have one failure, I guess. You can't, you can't just, you can't keep teach them all, you know? Okay. Are we good? You know what? I want regular time here. I need to know as soon as that ticks over to 21. Okay, there it is. Move to you to there. Okay. I think we're good. I think we did it. <laughs> I think we did I think we did it. Okay, everybody else looks good. 20 of 21. Come on, hit 21. It literally got pulled out mid-class. It's like, all right, you've learned everything you need. Get out of here and go to the other place. Okay, all right, so everybody should pass now. Oh my gosh. Talk about stressful. So uh, we also unlocked a couple other things. We unlocked... Uh, we unlocked, what was it? Is it environment? No, facilities probably. Playground. We unlocked a playground, so we probably should get a playground going. We need to get the fat, uh, staff break room going. We're going to see if we can get all our people to pass our thing, though. <laughs> That's what I want to see what happens. Okay, I believe it said after school today was going to be the uh, the exams. Exam countdown. 60 minutes left to the exam. Stay calm. Don't panic. Okay. We're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. The exam will be starting soon. Would the teachers please lead the students to the exam venue? All right, what will happen? Let's wait and see. Oh my gosh. Exam over. And oh geez. I wonder how the students did. Hey, they all passed. Oh my gosh. No students with full marks. <laughs> Student list. Uh, humanities, science pass score plus two plus two. So I guess they're good. Grades ranking. 
results. We did it. They all passed. Increased community relationship. We've done quite well in the last round of exams. Thank you for what you've done in the school. The school's reputation is among is is improving. So now does that mean headmaster the results are looking good? Our students are super smart. Nice job. So now does that mean that we're gonna get more? Um, today's bill has been generated. Eight hundred fifty-seven dollars. That's fine. What does that mean for us now? Does that mean that we are going to get more student applications? Number of staff, number of students, student applications. So student admission, list of new students. Oh, what is this? Gaming addict. <laughs> okay, uh, school, school satisfaction increased to high. So we have all of these kids here, but we still have kids. One semester down, have you gotten used to the headmaster? Oh my gosh, to... The year one students have all been moved to year two. Remember to build new classrooms for the new for the new year one students. They can't be assigned to the same classroom as new year two students after all. So these are two one. So now we have to generate a whole nother schedule for the oh my gosh. Wait, why are these all these are all like this is locked. Holy moly. Okay, so we've got like average course completion. Teacher proficiency. So our teacher proficiency is good, but how come these are locked? I'm curious. Unless like, can I change them? Hmm. Oh, is it because it's a literature 101 literature fundamentals? And these are fundamental courses. These are okay. So these are probably not fundamental courses. Interesting. But we can we can adjust this one, I guess. Interesting. So now we need to just focus on getting our teachers up and well, I guess I, you know, I don't actually know, but that's going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy make sure you leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, link down below if you want to check it out for yourself. Uh, let's school. Pretty cool stuff. Pretty fun. I'd like to see, uh, I'd like to get into this and see like what a bigger school looks like. So I might play a little bit on the side and see, uh, see what it looks like. But if you're interested, leave a comment. Let me know you want to see more. Anyways, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye everybody.